look at this crib In all of its glorious antiquery Every curve and surface speaks to me Saying pamper and spoil me Sand me and oil me, come on I know to the untrained eye it's boring But nothing's a chore when you're restoring Apart from frustration, pain, and financial drain It's fun! Folks say, Adam, why do you polish a crib when you don't have a kid? And even if you did have a kid, this crib is too precious for placing a baby inside it. So it simply exists to remind you your sense of perfection is just a reflection that you are not mentally prepared to make room for a kid. Adam, why don't you live, Adam? Just make a start. Are you willing to take the next step? Ready, set, ready, set. Look at these jugs. that ceramics is simply a manifestation of motherly panic by making a baby that's breakable aren't you creating a way of translating the terror of making maternal mistakes into clay hiding a waste you don't have to face being a bad mom barbara that's what you've done barbara just make a start are you willing to take the next step ready set Floorboards. You are absolutely right. Let's add it to the list with the cracks in the plaster. The Wi-Fi should be faster. This sofa needs a caster. The bathroom's a disaster. What about global poverty? What about world peace? And there's the whole darn economy. The whole Middle East. We should learn Mandarin. Yeah, or Spanish at least. No habla espanol. Hold or not It's a show about death. 